Okay, welcome back. We're doing another episode of Raft for the second video of Two Video Tuesday. We're going to continue where we left off. And once again, I'm not sure exactly where that is. Oh, yes. I do indeed remember. Check my inventory. Yes, we're doing some of the end game content today, aren't we? Uh, let me just grab this. I might need it. Do you know what? I'm actually going to make a spare one. Where are they? Right. Oh, I don't have the damn scrap. Right, I'll have to make one as we go then. If I remember correctly, I kind of pillaged this area already of scrap. Oh, no, no, there is scrap down there. Let's, uh... Whoa, let's just have a jump down here quick. Okay, uh, we didn't get bit. That's a good start. Just have a quick look-see. Right. I'm probably going to get bit any second now. Any second now. Oh, looks like... Out oh, there it is! That made me jump like a son of a bitch. Okay. We can afford to get bit again, although I'd prefer it if we didn't. Right, scrappy, scrappy, scrap. Just pick this up. Hopefully there was some scrap in there. It looked like there was a few bits. I need to come up for air. I need to come up for air. I need to come up for air. Damn, how low did I go then? Christ. Okay. Um, went round the long way, it looks like. Alrighty. Yes, lots of scrap now. That's awesome. Uh, where am I putting hinges and whatnot? Uh, in there? In there. Right. So, what was I doing? Oh, yes, this. Yeah, I'll make two. Just so I know I've got spares. I probably won't need them all. However, it's uh, good to be prepared, isn't it? Something that I don't do terribly well. I'm going to have a drinky drinky. Like so. Ah, the old routine. How do I miss it? Right, we need to get rid of this. Right, so we'll be using this thing today. So we need to head... Uh, I should have put this at a better angle. We need to head that way, this way. I believe that way. I think maybe a little bit more. Let me just have a look. This number here should be going down. It is rather rapidly. Now, this is a thing that I'm going to have to keep coming back to keep an eye on. Don't actually need to eat that food right now. Yeah, I'm going to have to keep my beady eye open. Because that is really important. I can't let the battery run down, otherwise it resets. It does appear we are heading straight at it at a decent speed, so that's good. That seagull just levitated out of the air rather than flying. That was an interesting little graphical problem. Right. Well... Um, we've got a little bit of scrap. I could do a little bit of building while I'm here then. How much spare wood do I have? Oh, loads. 
Loads and loads, right. And that could... Oh, loads and loads, loads and loads. No actual nails, but you know. Okay. Just pick up this stuff as we go. And we'll do a little bit of building. Why the hell not? There you go. I'm going to save the scrap that I've got left. Because I've made so many mistakes in the past using all of the um, scrap that I've got. Plus, I think the the outer wall is now finished. So We're down to nearly a 1,000 from 1,300. And that should mean we're heading right for it. Hopefully this is not going to take too long. I'll pick up uh, the stuff we collect along the way. There is a barrel over there, but I don't... Oh, that seagull's going to get scared off, isn't it? Yeah, it is. That was a dumb place to put that, really. Yeah, it's going down very slowly, but very surely. This is what we're heading towards. This is our radar screen. So this line here represents directly right of this device, which would be... Oh, 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 could you not do that? I'm poking. <laughs> I had to give Griff a poke through the slats of that platform. So, yes, yeah, that line there is that way. This line here is directly that way. So, this line here is between there and there. So we are going a little f bit too far to the right. Oh, we picked up a barrel. Well, isn't that convenient? Okay. Oh, yes, we are heading towards it a little bit faster now. That's a good thing. See, look, the battery's running out already. You can't let that get too low. It really becomes a problem. Because if you let the battery run out, it turns off. And if it's off for too long, the position of that thing that we're following resets. So uh, we need to avoid that. Oh, it's getting dark already. God damn. Oh, yeah, we're down nearly to 850 already. You get the little green lights on it. I don't know where I got the light bulbs for these things, but it's a bit slapdash the setup as well, isn't it? Let's face it. It's very fitting of the me. Yeah, all right, we're down to 850. I think we started at uh, 1,200, so we are barreling through. I mean, we're barreling through the ocean. I'm just going to spend the time between... Oh, okay, I accidentally slept. No, no, stand up, you idiot. Right, so... Where is it? Where is it? It's over there. Oh, and we've got a new seagull to scare. Yeah, wow. We went down by 50 overnight. Um, That was just from me accidentally sleeping gonna scoff that egg I've got time to get some water I will go ahead and do that just guzzle all of this I'm so paranoid I'm so paranoid about that thing I can hear it beeping and all the time my brain is going you must keep looking at it you must keep looking at it you must not ignore the beep and you must not ignore the battery either <laughs> I've got three spare batteries. It's more than enough. There's a raft there. I'm not going to go to it. I I really don't need what's on there at the moment. Although I will snag that barrel. <laughs> because I can. Right, so this battery is about to run out. 
And we're going to have a very limited time in which to fix it. Luckily, it's not a complicated process. Yep, we're down past 7.50. We are going great guns at the moment. Just going to have to be wary, I guess, is the phrase to use. That's going to run out any second. Any second now. And we're actually going a little bit off course. Let me adjust this. Right, so we have to pick up that battery and we have to dump this one in and turn it back on before the timer expires. Yeah, see, this dot started off down here and it's been drifting up here, so we are slightly off course. But now it is almost directly to our right. We can, in fact, adjust course and uh, still get where we're going. Might as well pick up those feathers. I don't have to worry about the battery for a while yet. Oh, oh, that's the wrong thing. You got so many of these feathers. I, I probably should make something with them, like arrows or whatnot, but I just don't need them at this point. Um, lots of spare plastic. Loads and loads of spare plastic. Um, I'm just going to put this empty one there. Don't know if you can recharge those or not. Oh, God damn it. Griff, trying to get sneak attack in on me. Don't, don't do that. I could stop and get the food from him, but I really don't want to. Yeah, we are drifting off again. So, if this is directly right of the device yeah I guess we are still not on a perfect heading I mean I, I doubt you'd ever be able to get it perfect but the number's going down and we're into the 500s at the moment what I'm going to do is I'll preemptively make one of these so I don't have to panic make one later Oh no. Stone. Did I bother picking up any stone? Oh, I don't have any stone. Oh, that's going to be an interesting setback, isn't it? Okay. Well, you, we can make a big anchor. Let's have a look to see what that takes. Three metal ingots and a hinge. All right. So we can swing that. Uh, one, two, three, and a hinge. We've got the resources to make it. It'll save us some time. It's just that I find that... Oh, now it's drifted back down there. So now we're going... Oh, there's an island as well. Damn it. We're going to have to... Oh, we've... It's reset. Why has it done that? That's odd. I, it might be because we came close to an island and the wind has changed. So, uh, yeah, back to square one on that. My apologies. Pick up all this stuff, I might as well. That's food. Yeah, so my paranoia about needing to watch that is gone kind of out of the window a little bit. Because now I'm going to have to keep an eye on it all over again. And is it going to change when we hit this island? I think that was the problem. An island spawned. And it messed something up. Let's just... Oh, way, oh, yeah. Okay, we're going to have a spinny do, aren't we? We're 
Right, okay. We are going to have to adjust again. So now, that is, this line is that way, and this line is that way, which means we need to head that way. Which is like that? I don't know. It's roughly like that. It's not entirely not that. Oh, now it's straight forwards. What the hell? Seriously, what the hell? Just what the hell? Look, the number is going down again rapidly. I feel like we just got back the way we came now. Okay, so it needs to point... Welcome to an episode of Mark adjusting the sail constantly and just watching this thing go beep, 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 beep. I felt like we were getting close, which was a shame. I don't know exactly why it reset. We are going to need to put another battery in there. I think we're all right for now. I just need to sort out my inventory again. This is going to be so, so uninteresting. I apologise to everybody. However, we are going on a mystical, wonderful, awesome -o adventure -o, Which is the same as a regular adventure, just with an extra O. I, I just emptied my inventory and then went and picked up a bunch more stuff. Because, you know, I can't help myself. While that's going, let's see if we can't put this down somewhere. Because, I mean, look at the damn size of this thing. Oh, it needs a hole, doesn't it? Okay, so let's make a hole. Oh, that was a, probably a dumb... Pl oh, that'll do. I'll just put it there. <laughs> I'll sleep with my feet on the bloody anchor. So I don't have to worry about making those temporary anchors anymore. We do appear to be going straight at it. Ish. I mean, it is a little off to the side, but... Again, we're making pretty good progress. I need to drink again. Why is my character so thirsty this episode? That's very odd indeed. Although, thank... God for this water purifier. It just it's just got so much in it. Right, ship ahoy! I mean ship go ship uh, onward. That was just <laughs> Bring me the horizon and the green beepy thing that goes with it. If this takes too long I'll just cut it. It's fine. If you suddenly see a whoosh cut to me being excited about seeing things on the horizon, then you know that nothing interesting happened. We are going a little bit off to the side, so let's bring that back. Doesn't help that I put this thing at an angle. That was the dumb thing to do. I don't see anything. I completely missed that barrel. Hey, there we go. <laughs> I got there in the end. Is it going further off to the left or is that just me? Like, do I have paranoia? I mean, I do have paranoia, but that doesn't mean it actually is drifting. Okay, so we have another empty battery. Yeah, it is. It appears to be drifting slightly further off to the left. I think that's all right for now. It's not that far off to the left. I'll just pull it back a little bit, I guess. Yeah, it's we're still chugging along. We're in the 500s. And we can stop now whenever we want. We can just stop and enjoy and get going again. And I don't have to panic build bloody anchors and stuff. 
Is that... I don't know what's going on in my head. I'm paranoid about this green dot. It was, like, there, and now it's all the way over there. And I don't want to adjust the sail too much, because we are heading in the right direction. I just can't see the destination. Currently. And it is a very obvious destination as well. I might need to make another battery. I might make one just for the hell of it. Just a safety battery. Uh, I need a copper ringer. Right, let's go get a copper ringer. That's the wrong box again. God damn it, Mark. Boosh. Right. And we'll dump the spare one. So, yes, we have one that's almost full and one spare. Yes, that's definitely going off that way more. So I think I need to bring this this way more. I, I, I'm probably just steering it wrong. Once I can see the thing that we're heading at, it will be easier because I could just point the sail at it and go that way. Numbers going down about the same, I guess. Um, I still can't see it. That's very, very odd. Can I make... Oh, can I not make binoculars? You can... There is a recipe for binoculars. Oh, bottles, bolts, go, oh, screw that. Yeah, that, that thing is still drifting off to the right. I mean, we're still going towards it, so I'm not that worried. I just thought adjusting that sail would pull it back round a little bit. I guess we aren't going in, in a perfectly straight line, so it would drift about a bit. Um... <sighs> yeah, only two empty... Oh, screw it. I'm not going to bother making all that. We're down to 200. Oh, look, there it is. That's the thing we're heading for. So I do, in fact, need to rotate that that way a little bit. Go away, seagull. You can see it through the... Sto it's weird that this happened during a storm. You can see it. You can see like there's a light up there. Oh, it's so exciting. It's exciting things. It's exciting me. We're definitely going to go explore that. If we can even see the damn thing. Let's get there first, and then I'll have a sleepy sleepy. A sleepy DPD. And, um... So we can actually, you know see it properly it's so strange we do appear to be heading straight for it so that's you know a good thing it looks rather kind of sinister just that tower with the light on the top just somewhat into the distance we're less than 200 uh numbers i guess away from it meters i don't think they're miles i think that would be a bit of a stretch if they were miles um yeah i'm not sure what this unit of distance is if i'm perfectly honest luckily we don't really need this because we can see where we're heading it's this thing this thing in the distance, rising up from the horizon into the storm of our vision, or something sounding like that. Okay, yeah, we can see it now. I tried to zoom in with the mouse wheel, just tried to zoom my eyes in. So this is what the game has been building to up until this point. Finding one of these. We 
are heading a little bit past it. I'm just going to steer it in a little bit. Or, or a lot. I, I'm... Yeah, let's steer this in a little bit more. So we can head right at it. It seems like we're going really very slow now. But we're not heading directly into the wind as we were before, so it's going to be a bit of a slow crawl on this last section. Oh, can I speed this up with a paddle? Let's speed this up with a paddle, shall we? You can see it's like, I don't know, like those mobile office units that companies use Ugh. oh my god there's so many of these back when i was at school when i was like 15 16 we had so many of these in our school because it was undergoing heavy renovations right let's go this way some more yeah baby Right, let's drop the anchor. Uh, drop, drop, drop the anchor. And there we go. We have arrived at our destination. I, I'm just going to turn that off. The beeping is actually starting to get annoying to me. I'm going to clear, clear the nets and the griff. Hey, griff. You cannot stop me, Griff. I am already here. You are too late. And other things that make you sound like a bad movie villain. Um. Right. Okay. Okay. Let's clear the nets. Damn, we picked up a lot on the way through here, didn't we? God damn. I now cannot open boxes. Yes, I can. Right. I'm just going to dump some of this in here. I've got so much extra wood, it's unreal. And the other box is full. Can't be bothered to empty it. Uh, let me... Oh, let me have a quick stink. I am stinking very hard. Just going to... Yeah, I'm just going to dump some of this. In places where it wouldn't normally go. I'll have plenty of time to sort it out. Don't need the batteries anymore. Don't need the paddle. I will top up on water though, because I'm starting to get low and I hadn't even noticed. And it is starting to get light, which will be good for our exploration of this. Um, I'll do that. There we go. I'll pick up some extra eggs in case I get hungry. Like so. The problem is, while I'm up there exploring, Griff is going to be biting big holes in my uh, raft, isn't he? And there's not a lot I can do about it. Right, let's go have an explore. Our first part of parkour. Parkour! Oh, a bit of a frame rate issue as I jumped there. So yeah, look. I mean, there's boxes and beds and chairs and... Signs of civilization. Loot. There's also plenty of loot. And we will get probably not all of it, but probably also most of it. Yeah, I said a bunch of stuff. Um, Did we go in here yet? No, just empty plastic barrels. Quick phone for help. Quick, very low res phone for help. It, it it didn't help. Oh, can I take this? Oh, oh, oh he's let. No, all right. <laughs> That'd be good to have on the raft. Uh, I've been in here. Right. So where do we go from here? Somewhat obvious parkour platforms. All oh, the music's kicked in. Let's have a look. Oh, there's another crate. I say another crate, just a crate. Um, oh look, I can get up there. 
Right, let's go ahead and do that. Up on the bin. Up on the filing cabinet, I assume. Y y yes. Oh, again, a bit of a frame rate issue. Not sure what that's all about. It's a bit disturbing. Uh, oh, look, a kitchen. I'm just going to live here. I mean, this place seems pretty awesome. I've got plenty of griffs for food. Loads of good loot in here. Oh, I'm, ba I'm back into the kitchen. All right, we'll go up the stairs then, shall we? Um, oh yeah, I remember this part. I thought I had to parkour onto that and then up to there. Didn't even really pay attention to the fact there's a really easily, like, a really easy path to walk along. Oh, <laughs> I was just saying it's really easy. Nearly didn't make it. Just gonna walk along here. Oh, pong. There we go. I just randomly yelled pong into the microphone. I'm going to have to mute that a bit in editing more work for myself on a day where i've got double the amount of work well done mark a wise and brave decision it's another like little kitchen area that's really weird and interesting everything is weird and interesting oh i've just realized as well i can just hop up there oh we're almost there uh, yeah, parkour! Yes. Oh, do not run off the edge. That's something else I did when I, f the first, like, on my single player, I ran straight off that edge, and I think this rock was over there, so I just went splat. Didn't die, but, you know, didn't have a hell of a lot of health. And here it is! Are you ready for the reveal? Boosh. So, yeah, this is what this has all been leading to. We are apparently, in a future update, because it hasn't been added yet, going to be looking for this. This utopia. This is Earth on the 20th of the 2nd, 2028. Lots and lots of water. Australia completely covered in water. All ice will melt. Scientists estimate in two years. What the hell did we do to melt all the ice in two years? God damn. We screwed something up really, really badly. Water levels expected to rise hundreds of meters. Yeah. I like the way that the, the water level is rising hundreds of meters, and yet the whole planet is underwater, apparently. Apart from the bit that I'm stood on. So. Yeah, apparently this is there, but we've got no way of telling where this is at the moment. I'm sure that's another thing the devs are going to add. They've got a receiver that looks better than mine. Can I, can I take this as well? No. <laughs> Just bust it by throwing the hook at it. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, that is the... Season finale of Raft, I'm afraid. Do not fear, I will absolutely be playing more. When the devs add content, which gives me something new to do, I will do it. We'll start season two, probably from here, maybe from the beginning, depending on how that goes. And we will revisit the Raft, and we will all... We also revisit Griff, who I can see suspiciously swimming around down there. So, I'd just like to thank everybody who's been watching this series. I've loved it. I love this game. It is so much fun. I will probably continue to play it single player or with Faust Phoenix off camera. Might do a little like mini series um, as a two player maybe. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment and throw me a like. If you're new on the channel, subscribe and you'll be able to get notified of all the content that I upload to YouTube, which is about every other day at this point. I've not had a great week for sleep and so i i've been you know taking a day off here and there just to rest. Otherwise, it's going to be videos about me complaining 
entirely about how tired I am and things like that. So nobody wants to hear that, and I'm sure no one cares. Anyway, excuse the ramblings. I did that on the last video, which was Typo Man, I think, part five. And I'm doing it again now. So I'm going to leave. Once again, thank you, everybody, for joining me on this journey. I will see you soon. And um, let me know what other games you're interested, you know, in seeing me play. Thanks very much and good evening. Oh, loads, loads and loads.